what it's doing. Oh, it's holding back. It ain't went down to zero. And that's about where it was after I let the, after I took the uh, the red hose off and got put the compressor up while ago, the little vacuum pump up thing. So if it had a bad leak in it, it would have went down to zero. By and plus, these hoses ain't the best in the world. So I think it's going to be all right, Paul Paul. Let's plug her in and blow her up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So the first time we did, now this is off. Got that off. I'm going to open this up. Open it up. Open up the cane really good. And you want to take do a little bit like that right there. Just um, add in this a hand. Never, never a cheating can now. Right. Oh, whoa, ho, pop, ho, ho. Just let it ease on in now. Let's plug her in. Plug her in and blow her up. All right. I know. She is in negative. Whoa. I'll tell you what, if that light, if that's a line more behind my house doing that, that's the sorriest ass dang thing I ever heard. That's a noisy crap there. Boop, 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 doop, doop, doop. All right. Where were I? Where were I? I was right here. Fitting that. See, I'm turning my, I'm leaving my can upwards too. I don't never, you don't flick it upside down. You, you want vapor in there. You don't want liquid. All right, let's see. Yeah, I see, it's still in there. I feel the can getting cold. You see it frosting up, getting cool in it. There's some gas going in, Paul Paul. Turn it all wide open. Not a wide open. But see, I what I'm what I'm doing is I'm turning this little release valve right here because I don't want to add this in too fast. That is the key. You don't want that to go in there. You, what you do if you choke it down, it's just as bad as if it ain't got any in it. I'm feeling the can. I can feel the can. It's cold to the touch. That means there's gas flowing out of it. So it's the compressor's pulling. When I and when I shut this valve off, see it's pulling it down into into the red zone. We want it out of the red. We want it to get it to zero, between zero and five. When we get through with this, we don't want to exceed five pounds. While we're charging it, we don't want it to go above ten for fear that we'll flood or wreak havoc on the little reed valves that are in there. So we don't want to we don't want to force it in too fast. We don't want a liquid going in, but we want to. Let it go in nice and easy. And slow. Nice and slow. Alright. When, when all the smoke and bells and whistles is over with, we are shooting for, I am, I like to go for 5 PSI. It's a little bit high, but when you, you take the hose off, you lose a little bit. So it's still, it's now it's around negative 10, see, it's still in red, so it's, it's, it's taking it, it's going on in. Now, 
you probably can go over 10, a little, or 20, or you can do what you want to, but this is the safe way to do it. You don't overfill it, and you don't flood it. You don't want to flood it. You go flooding it, you're just doing just as bad as it don't have none in it. All right, now it's reading around, it's still in red. See that, it's still in red. Ease a little more in our JW. I can feel it going in because the can's getting frosty on my hand. It's getting cold. I can feel it. Now sometimes when it's cold, cold weather, it don't want to go in right. You can stick it in a, a bucket of warm water, thaw it out a little bit, and then go in a little faster if you had to. You know, but that's not necessary. It's 99 degrees in the shade out here. Good old Moore Bills, Alabama. Let's see, now I got about 2 PSI. All right. I like to get it up about, I say about 5 PSI and where to, if it'll sit at 5 and stay, then you're done. It's almost there, too. Almost there. Right, maybe we can get it charged before that raggedy-ass lawnmower comes back through here, you know, making all that damn noise. All right, there it is. All we got to do is now shut off this here. That off. That's already off. Set that down. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see what the cross line looks like inside, Paw Paw. Just for shits and giggles. Oh. Look at that. Look at that. Right there. Now that's what it looks like now. Let's come back later on and see what it looks like. Alright, the um I put the backsplash back on it and the flow board back in and wipe it out a little bit. Uh my job is to fix them, not clean them. <laughs> that's somebody else's ass clean them up. Now, we'll get a couple of empty ice trays and fill them up with some H2O and stick them in there and come back a little later on maybe tomorrow morning and see what it looks like. Alright, now that's blowing some nice cool air. I've got some, I'm going to put some, uh, just now put two ice trays of H2O up in here and we'll wait till tomorrow and see if we got any ice. Then we'll know something. Hopefully she'll hold up. I believe she will. Because I kind of waited around. Oh, I don't know. I... Let's see. Yeah, pop all the video. With the cam. Pop off in with the cam. Let's see. I waited around about. Hmm, about an hour or two. Maybe three. And it helped vacuum. Now pressure is different from vacuum, but most time when it'll hold, uh, you know, when it'll hold vacuum, most times it'll have pretty good luck with, with uh, cause it's only got like a no more than a third of a can, a little tiny can of gas in it. So, uh, we shall see. Play it again.